Well, hey there, friends and followers of Tales of the Magic Skagit. I'm in one of my happy places, one of my many. But this one in Laconner is Beaver Tales Coffee and Tea. And uh, Beaver Tales always has some great art and artifacts throughout their coffee shop. But now, and for I think the next month, they're going to have some really beautiful artwork. And it's the creation of this gentleman right here. I want to introduce you to Kent Norby. Kent. Um, so how did you happen to uh, end up showing your paintings here at Beaver Tales? Well, I live here in the corner, and I came here to get a coffee one day. And uh, I got to talking with the owner, Michelle. And she let me know that they do like to show local artists work here. So I said, I'll come back with a few of my pieces uh, to show you. And if you like, uh, we can uh, do a display here. Oh, fantastic. Now, there are <laughs> this stuff is stunning. <laughs> and in fact, what really drew me in was the one from uh, Evie's Prairie. Yeah. Because I responded to that immediately and thought, oh, that. Is that, that's got to be Evie's Prairie, yeah. sure enough. It definitely is. I go hiking there or go, go for walks there all the time. Um, but this is a, from a photograph that I took, um, like a kind of a focused in uh, right. shot. I'm actually working on a much larger piece now that takes some kind of like the whole uh, you know, prairie area. Oh, fantastic. Um, so it's going to be a two foot by three feet painting. And that should be, uh, hopefully it'll look, look good. It'll be like a bigger, more oh. expansive version of that. Oh, I, so, okay. You're, you're going to have to let me know. When yeah, I'm you're going to let me know when that is done. <laughs> we have to take a look at that. It's coming along nicely so far. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah. Now, I can tell that you have a thing about landscapes. For sure. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, I'm from Seattle, and I grew up looking out over Lake Washington and the Cascade Mountains. And uh, I've just always loved the landscapes here. I love mountains. I love the greenery. I love the water. Um, of course, when you're around here, looking around, like everywhere you look, it's beautiful. Um, so I just try to get as much of that as I can into my paintings. How long have you been painting? About 10 years now, actually. Um, I started December of 2013. That was when I did my first painting. And uh, so now, oh no, 2020, 2012, pardon me. Um, so now I've been painting for just over 10 years. Mostly self-taught. I took a couple classes, but otherwise I've just been painting on my right. own. Right. So what was it in, that inspired you to begin painting, I mean, well into your adult life? So I'd always liked art, but I think that I just thought that I didn't have any special talent uh, or something like that, so I never really put much effort into it. Um, but I got some uh, painting supplies uh, as a gift, and so I just decided to do a painting for the fun of it. And it wasn't a very good painting, but it was fun. And so I did another one and another one, and um, pretty soon I was hooked. I mean, it didn't take long, and I've been painting basically nonstop ever since. Well, I, I love your work. Where else? Where else can we find you? Um, so I do have a website. It's kentnorby.com. Um, and it's N O R B Y, folks. Kent N O R B Y. D B Y. D B Y. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. Um, and I also show every fall and spring at the River Gallery, which is a gallery just outside of McConnor. Um, and so they have a spring show and a fall show every year. Um, I'll be there this spring, all, all of April. I'll have works at the River Gallery. Um, and if you live in the O'Connor area, that's sort of uh, just off of Dodge Valley Road. Yeah. And um, the, their website is rivergallerywa, like Washington.com. All right. So they have a, and they'll have the spring show loaded up in, a, in two or three weeks with all the, as a preview with all the work. Excellent. That. Excellent. And again, Kent, tell us your website www.kentnordeby, N O R D B Y.com. Excellent. Kent, thanks so much. Thank Appreciate you. it. It's great to have you here. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thanks.